two. Okay. Right. Let's be productive about this. Okay, 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 okay. Listen for the noises and sounds. Keep an eye on Fredster back here because of that reason. I don't think I need to worry about the closet until I like see it moving. Wait. Can't hear anything. No. You've really got to listen closely because I think that the the um the breathing that you're supposed to hear is quite faint. And as soon as you flash that light if they're outside your door you are dead. But nothing as of yet. Freddy's behaving himself. I can hear something. Oh, I don't know if one of them's in the room or. No. Maybe it was just that. Oh, this is stressful. It's ridiculous because you don't know. If you don't listen to them sounds. Then you're just going to have a fucking animatronic in your face. And that is a ridiculous thought. Let me just check this just in case. But I think Foxy is gracing us with his presence just yet. There's breathing. I'm sure I heard a breath there. I'm going to leave that there. Nope, nothing there. <laughs> right I don't know when they leave that is the only thing I'm not going to be able to get to grips with right now is when do they leave the door <laughs> fucking hell okay it's fine You behaving, Freddy? No. Ooh. Ah, Bonnie. Behave, please. Behave. Behave yourself. Okay, I think he's gone. Unless he hasn't and he's about to rip me to shreds. Oh, hello Chica. It reflects in the window and everything. Scott has done a fucking incredible job with this game. I'm, re I'm really excited to see how this fits into the timeline and like what the significance of it being played as a child in a house is to the Fazbear restaurants. Obviously you've got all the animatronics but they're nightmare animatronics so it begs the question of God, both there, of if this child is dreaming 
that this is happening. I, I don't know. I don't know. There are so many theories and I've got plenty of ideas of my own but, you know, none of them stand up until we know what the deal is. Really. Let's check on Bonnie again before we check Freddy. No, he's gone. Behave. Stupid little teddy bear. Yeah, chica. Chica, chica, chica. I don't know when uh, Foxy becomes active. Whether it's like on a certain night or. Go away. Go away, Bonnie. What is your deal? Hmm. This game seems actually. That look like Foxy. This game seems actually quite manageable, was what I was about to say. Um, but again, I'm no, I mean, I'm not going to say I'm an expert at Five Nights at Freddy's. I'm not 2020, I'm not 20 mode expert, but I've completed all the other games to completion, including the five stars of Five Nights at Freddy's 3, so I kind of know what I'm talking about. But every time a new game launches, It's something different. <laughs> Chica, fuck off. Oh, no. Okay. Okay. Webs. Webs. God, the breathing is so light. It doesn't even. You can't hear it half the time. I've got like better headphones on. I've got actually headphones on. But I've only got one over I've only got one over my ear because I don't want to talk too loudly. Because it's like three AM. Just gone probably. Yeah, quarter past three in the morning. And I have neighbours. Ah, it's a chica, I saw that. <laughs> Fucking hell, buddy. <laughs> <sighs> this is only the second night. I breeze past the first one. It can't be that much more difficult yet. Well, I'm not going to complete this fucking game. <laughs> Bloody hell. I think this game will clear up most of the... Most of the questions. I would kind of like to be left with some mystery though, I think. Because I think if everything was revealed, like, Five Nights at Freddy's, it's now I closed the door! How long have I got to keep it shut for? Also, they can get into the room. Yes. I was talking to one of my friends about it a couple of hours ago, and they said, he said, do you think Scott will have a hard time letting go of Five Nights at Freddy's now that this game is done? And I was like, well, first of all, He's not quite letting go of it because of the DLC and uh, the film. Um, but also, I think the internet and the players of Five Nights at Freddy's, like the big fans like me, um, and like a lot of the people I know, a lot of other people on the internet, they will have a hard time letting go of Five Nights at Freddy's because once it's done, there's nothing else for them to predict what might happen, there's nothing else that will, for them to predict might be confirmed as part of the storyline, so yes I think Scott will probably miss working on the game series a hell of a lot, I mean if I created a game as successful as Five Nights at Freddy's I wouldn't want to let it go, but of course you, there, you can run things into the ground, so it's, it's probably a good thing that he's just finishing it with like, like now 
but I think the internet will probably miss miss it more than Scott will, if you know what I mean. Like, for me, like, it's sad that it's the last Five Nights at Freddy's game, even though I know there will be more. Fucking Chica! Ugh. Wasn't paying attention and was too occupied by the hospital thing. Am I in a hospital bed? Was I just imagining that? I saw like a tube thing on a stand with like the bottles of like liquids. <laughs> I heard it as well. I still fucking click the wrong. I clicked the wrong button. Fuck you, Foxy. Ah. Ah, oh, that's cute. Let's leave him like that. You could stay like that, that'd be good. Why are the lights flickering? Ah, did you move? I feel like my brain is going to explode. I don't know what the fuck I'm doing anymore. <laughs> Should have just closed the door again. Just close the door again. Oh fuck's sake. There was no sound. Obviously, I've got to wait longer. I've got to wait longer. Solve all my problems. <laughs> what the fuck was that? Last go tonight this is my last attempt at the second night because I might be able to do it better on some sleep, if I'm honest. 